Hello everyone and welcome back to Mass Effect 2. In the last session we got Kasumi. No messages for you, Commander. Thank you. <laughs> we uh, we got Kasumi from the Citadel. We did a funny little uh, box side quest where we had to stop boxes from di being destroyed. Uh, and today we have a plan. And that plan is to do the remaining two dossiers for the Warlord and the Convict. That is what I would like to do first. And then maybe we'll go on to some DLC stuff. Maybe we'll do the N7 stuff. I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. Um, but my, my primary plan for today, the first thing I'm going to do is these remaining two dossiers. So... The question is, which do we do first? The other question is, did I feed the fish last time? And I, I don't remember, so I'm going to feed them again. Hopefully they can't die from overfeeding. <laughs> now that would be a real tragedy. Lovely jubbly. Okay, so. So, 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 so. Which one? What have we got? We've got the Convict, Jack, Exceptional Biotic Ability... Note, criminal background, currently in custody. Jack is rumoured to be the most powerful human biotic ever encountered. Right, yeah, I think we did read this, actually. Very little additional data regarding Jack is available, except the subject has a history of violence and should be approached carefully. Currently, Jack is being held on the Turian prison ship Purgatory. Cerberus has negotiated for the prisoner's release. And the warlord, Dr. Okia. Millennia of combat and strategic experience. Rumoured familiarity with collector technology. A brilliant and brutal Krogan warlord who fought in the Krogan rebellions, Dr. Okir has become obsessed with saving the Krogan people from the genophage and is believed to have contacted the collectors in an attempt to gain technology to that end. He is currently in a Blue Suns camp on Corlys, though the nature of his relationship with the mercenary group is unknown. I'm very interested in both of these. They both sound very good. Uh, <laughs> I'm sure this one will spark lots of lovely comments about the genophage, as any discussion of the genophage seems to do. Uh, let us do... Ip dip do... Let's do the convict. Uh, purgatory... Uh, where does it say? Purgatory... Da, da, da. Hmm, it's not giving me a, like, a system. Actually, I guess it just says it on the map, right? There are, like, everything is noted on the map in this game, whereas in uh, the previous one you sort of had to read the description and then work it out from there. Oh, is there other stuff? Oh, interesting. There, there wasn't any other uh, places in where the Citadel was before, right? It was just that that place just had the Citadel and that was it kind of thing. And that's also where this is where Kasumi's mission is as well. That's interesting. Um... But that is not what we are doing today. We are doing... Recruit the Convict. Yeet! Do, 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 do. Okay, yes. We've been here. We've scanned a lot of this stuff. Once an Ark ship now holds prisoners. Uh... Blue Suns turn skilled or fit prisoners over to Batarian slavers, but few have ever seen the transaction and live to tell about it. Its population is three times the estimates due to overcrowding. Okie dokie. Let's dock. Right. Right. Okay. So. We're definitely taking Garrus. Oh, he has different appearances. Hmm. Hmm. I quite like both of them. I think we'll stick with this damaged one, though. I kind of like the narrative continuity of that. Although I guess it would make sense that he gets a new one because his old one's damaged. But maybe he has some. He has some attachment to this one. Let's go with. Uh, does anyone else have different outfits? Uh, Kasumi doesn't. Jacob doesn't. Miranda does, but it's awful. Blech. None for Morden. None for Zaid. Okay. Um... Right, so, Garrus, you're coming along, and... Uh... Should we take Kasumi, because we haven't... Haven't brought her along anywhere yet, because we literally just got her? Sounds like a plan. 
Right, what do you have? Shadow Strike. Cloak and sneak behind a target to deliver a devastating blow. That sounds pretty good. Overload, we know what Overload does. We've had uh, had a few, I think this is, is, it, is she the third character with Overload? Uh, shields and synthetics. Master Thief is the usual. Uh, damage and health and stuff. Re reduce uh, recharge time on powers would be very nice. Oh, and she has a flashbang grenade. I still have, like, never used that, pretty much. <laughs> the flashbang grenade. I I have it, but I, I almost never use it. I should I should change that. Uh, yes, that sounds pretty good. Oh, well, that's a loyalty thing for her. Okay. Uh, well. Recharge time, 9 seconds. Damage, 300. 350, 400... Kind of tempted to just put everything in this, to be honest. Hmm. Increases the final one increases the damage done when assassinating the target, or reduce the cooldown if the target is killed. But the cooldown's only nine seconds, so that's not that bad anyway. I wonder how much. It doesn't say how much it reduces the cooldown by. If it's like a second, then not worth it. If it's by eight seconds, and you suddenly have a one second until you could do it again, that's worth it. I feel like that's information it should give. Let's go with that. That seemed good. I think that seems good. We have nothing. Garrus has nothing. Cool. Cool. Oh, uh, weapon loadout. What have you got? Automatically chooses the best thing. Cool, cool. Uh, right. Let's go. Hello, friends. Or probably not friends. There's our lovely little ship. Anything we can look at new? Uh, let us start by... Oh, I can't bring up my... Power wheel. I was going to map the powers to the D-pad, but no can do right now. Welcome to the Purgatory, Shepard. Your package is being prepped, and you can claim it shortly. My package? As this is a high-security vessel, you'll need to relinquish your weapons before we proceed. Uh, no. I can't do that. Everyone stand down. Commander, I'm Warden Kirill, and this is my ship. Your weapons will be returned on the way out. You must realize this is just a standard procedure. <laughs> I, I I get that it's standard procedure, but I'm going to keep my weapons. It's my standard procedure to keep my gun. Let them proceed. Our facility is more than secure enough to handle three armed guests. We're bringing Jack out of cryo. As soon as the fund's clear, you can be on your way. If you'll follow me to out-processing for the pickup, Commander. Let's go. Hmm. This is... Okay. Going a lot more smoothly than I was expecting. So They're just going to hand her over. As you can see, we keep tight control over the population. My bad for thinking Jack was a dude, by the way. <laughs> I just assumed with the name. But, uh, you guys. Each prisoner certainly let me know. <laughs> self-contained modular unit. I've blown a few out the airlocks as an example. The ship is made up of 30 cell blocks identical to this one. We house thousands of criminals. We can put the whole place in lockdown on a moment's notice. Nothing goes wrong here. Can you tell me about Jack? Cerberus hasn't told you. Jack is the meanest handful of violence and hate I've ever encountered. Dangerous, crazy, and very powerful. You'll see soon enough. Yikes. How'd you end up running this ship? I was in law enforcement on Palavin. And got sick of seeing criminals escape out into the galaxy to carry on with their crimes. Bounty hunters aren't dependable. Eventually, I hit upon this idea. 
Keep the criminals in space, and the galaxy is a safer place. You do this because you think it's necessary? Every day I see the worst sapient life has to offer. Governments are soft, unwilling to make the hard choices. Someone had to stand up and make the galaxy safe. Maintaining a population this size in space can't be cheap. We can cut corners that governments can't, and each prisoner brings in a fee from his home world. Wait, what? These individuals are violent, and their home planets pay well to keep them here. Oh! <laughs> what happens if the home world doesn't want to pay? We explain that we can't maintain the prisoner without their help, so we'll be forced to release him back onto his home world at an unspecified place and time. <laughs> so it's wow. an extortion racket. You don't have to agree with my methods, but don't question my motives. These are despicable people, and I'm keeping them locked up. Let's get on with this. Have there been escape attempts? We're in space. They have nowhere to go, and they know it. But still, we exercise extreme caution. These are dangerous individuals. Oh, wow. Okay. We have many ways to control the population. I'm going to confirm that the funds from Cerberus cleared. Our processing is straight down this hallway. Just keep going past the interrogation rooms and the Supermax wing. I'll catch up with you later, Shepard. Okay, this is uh, an interesting joint. But it's an interesting thought, prison in space, so there can really be no escape attempts because, like, if you make it out yourself, you make it to the front door, like, this ain't prison break. <laughs> you, you make it out, you dig your tunnel, whatever. You then hit the vacuum of space. So you'd have to get a ship, and I imagine that ships are all very tightly controlled as well. Torture. Oh, Jesus. These are some sick freaks. Well, that's not okay. Is there something I can do for you? There's no excuse for beating a prisoner who can't fight back. This is a massage compared to what his victims went through. Ah, oh, I see. Two wrongs make a right. This degrades you as much as him. We have orders. You're not important enough to make your own decisions? I admit, I sometimes get tired of this. Does this really get us anything useful? Stop this. For your own sake. Yeah, you're right. Call it off. At least for now. Jesus. Your package will be at out processing just down the hall. Hey. Hey guys, over here. Let me ask you something. If you're buying prisoners, can you buy me? Man, I, I don't care where you take me or what you do to me. It's got to be better than this. We're here for Jack. Jack? Forget what I just said. I don't want to go nowhere with you. <laughs> wow, people are scared of this Jack character. I thought this ship was a prison, not a market. Sometimes people buy cons so they can do some punishing of their own, if you understand. Warden sells this to whoever can pay enough. Right, so it's really not about keeping criminals in jail. It's really about him making as much money as possible. Why are they interrogating that prisoner? He knows something? Nah, that's Bimmy. He don't know nothing. He offed someone in the showers yesterday, I think. Christ. The guy he killed was worth a lot to the warden. Yeah, sucks to be Bimmy right now. They're going at it pretty hard. Do they ever kill prisoners by accident? I haven't heard of anyone dying. Warden can't make money off us if we're dead. Funny thing, though. The more a guard does it, the meaner he gets. So they rotate him through. Yikes! So, what are you in for? I killed a few people. Only about 20 or so. Only but about 20 or so. Habitat. Small time compared to most of the guys here. Fuck me. What's it like here? Bad. And you gotta watch out. Damn, but someone's always after your stuff. Your smokes, your clothes, your... Pride. I haven't taken a shower in three months. Yeesh. Tell me more about Jack. The worst trouble you ever saw. Mixed with some crazy and way too much biotic power. 
That's all I'm saying. Uh, that's everything, right? I should go. Wish I could go. Oh boy. I mean, these are clearly terrible people that are locked up in here, but <laughs> you still shouldn't be treating them like that. I hear the screaming in my head. It's nice. Yeah. Okay. Right. Uh objective is that way. So, what's this way? Thanks for that tip about there's no there's no map, but if you tap that it will give you the arrow. That is very useful. This is the Supermax wing. It's off limits. Out processing is back down the hall on your right. They'll bring your package there after the cryothaw is finished. Cryothaw? <laughs> Jack's been fucking in stasis. Jack will be brought to you in out processing. Back down the hall on your right. I can't let you into the Supermax wing. Out processing is through the door on the far side of the room. I. I... Wow, this uh, room sure does seem laid out in a way where the desks are cover. <laughs> I've got a feeling we're going to be fighting through here. My apologies, Shepard. You're more valuable as a prisoner than a customer. What? Drop your weapons and proceed into this open cell. You will not be harmed. Well... <laughs> oh, I think I have just immediately predicted that. What about serving the galaxy? You talked up your noble intentions with this prison, but it turns out you're a criminal like the rest. Activate systems. Oh, I was so right. I was so right. I knew this looked too much like cover. Okay, okay. So, what have we got? Kasumi's just got pistols. Alrighty. I've got my shotgun. Uh... Let me turn on my incendiary ammo. Concussive shot ready. Turn on my incendiary ammo for this as well. Okay. Uh, we need to. Let's put shadow strike on right. That seems like something I want to be constantly using. Uh, do these guys have shields. Some of them do, so overload would be good for that, but I feel like probably better to go for concussive at the moment. Sound good? Sounds good. Shields are down! Going down. Understood. That was weird. I pressed, uh, I pressed Y like multiple times with the doggo right in front of me, and it just didn't, didn't let me. <laughs> it's like that. That's uh, not happening. I'll take care of it. Interesting. Okay. Fires that in a in a line moving forwards. Okay. That's the first time I've got a proper look at that one. Okay, now we're going to max security. <laughs> Get a load of this fucking warden dickhead. Oh boy, okay. Now you see me. Got him. That went well. Shepard is on the loose. Repeat, Shepard. Hi! Heh <laughs> Oh, purgatory security controls. Shepard, if you hack that control, every door on the cell block opens. It's the only way to get Jack out of there. I'm doing it. 
Be ready. That is an interesting look. <laughs> Are we going to get a biotic showcase here? Yeah, we are. We have to get down there. Okay, sick, sick. Uh, that's the objective way. Oh, we love to see Element Zero. Fucking rarest shit ever. What's my left bumper again? Oh, my left bumper is the flashbang. Okay. Cool, cool. They're attacking Jack. We're coming, Jack. Oh, God. I don't think Jack needs our help, honestly. <laughs> well, this is very inhumane looking. Oh, wait, what was that? Scan? Hello, hello. This might be useful. Damage protection, yes! Oh, fuck yeah, we need that. We need damage protection, and then we can get the shields have a chance to instantly refill when they deplete. Oh, that's good. Oh, fuck yeah. Don't kill Jack, eh? You got a buyer lined up or something? I mean, you did have Cerberus lined up, but... seven, nine, and eleven have lost life support. No survivors. Wow, you are getting fucked up. 1,500 credits. Nice, nice. Oh, Jack! We're here to help. Lol. This shall be easy to track. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's a uh, good point. Oh, I can't go down here? Wait. Oh, I thought I was fucked. <laughs> Going silent. All prisoners, return to your cells and be your first. Just locked down the area behind you. You must find another exit route. I'll take the shot. All damage has led to overload. Core system's failure imminent. Oh, hello. Trying to, it's not letting me. Like, he's right in front of me, but it's not giving me the fucking red thing around him. <laughs> I guess we just don't need it. Oh, fuck. I didn't even notice my health. I thought I couldn't do a power on him unless he has the red outline around him, and the red outline just wasn't showing up. But, uh. I guess it was just bugged out. Warning. Warning. Jack. We can use this. All guard for store order. Lethal force authorized. But don't kill Jack. Tex, lockdown. Sector 7, 9, and 11 have lost life support. No survivors. Okie dokie. Take two. All prisoners, return to your cells immediately or I'll open every airlock on this ship. Oh god, I'm on the wrong side of the cover. Ow. Uh, Garrus, is your cooldown almost up? <laughs> Damn, that did not do a whole lot, did it? <laughs>
Okay, that's better. <clears throat> Never take those guys on one on one. Like, always stay as far back from them as possible is the lesson I am very quickly learning in this game. <laughs> Every time I attempt to shotgun those guys, it ends in my instant death. So, never do that. Alrighty. This guard got swarmed by prisoners with hey! the He never had a chance. Shotgun damage. It shows you what kind of people these prisoners are. I don't agree with everything they do here, but it's in the galaxy's best interests. This guard kept maniacs away from innocent people. Oh boy. One of these. Okay, what have we got? Green, purple, top right, green, bottom left. Uh, fuck, I saw it and then it was gone. Big orange block descending right. Uh, green, purple again. There we go. It's really annoying that you can't, like... It Often there'll be one and you spot it just as it starts scrolling off the top of the screen. And even if you can see, like, 99% of it, if 1% of it is off the top of the screen, you can't scroll up and click it. Lockdown in blocks 4, 7, and 8. Love that. God, these guards have got some cash. I loot one dude here, and it gives me as much cash as that entire fucking crate side mission gave me. <laughs> this should punch through their armor. <laughs> My pleasure. Not bad, not bad. You know what? You know what? I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. Squad power usage off. I don't know why I'm feeling it. Breached in sectors 12, 14, and 30. No survivors. Oh Jesus. I don't know why I'm feeling it so much more in this game. In Mass Effect 1, I was like, I really don't feel like micromanaging this. I guess it's because you have more options to do it without going into the weapon wheel and stuff. But yeah, Mass Effect 1, I was like totally happy to let them do whatever the fuck they liked. And in this game, I'm really feeling like I want to do it myself. Not entirely sure what the reason is for me changing how I feel on that, but uh, that is how it is. Okay. Oh no, wait, what's hitting me? I'm about to die. Oh, fuck. And I just used my power so I can't charge into him to get shields back. So I think there's nothing I can do in this situation. I didn't realize I missed someone. Motherfucker. Yeah. Well, take two. Lockdown in blocks four, seven, and eight. Let me just make sure. Did I get that? Okay, yeah. It saved after I got that shotgun damage thing. Where was this guy? Oh, he must have been under the bridge, probably. Uh, let's try flashbang. Flashbang, pretty good. 
flashbang, pretty good. Nice. Just trying to get him a little bit closer. Man, overload on those shields does fucking nothing. Uh, what should we go for? What should we go for? I'm just using this to take a moment to pause, seeing as he's about to arrive at me. Uh, you've both got overload, actually. Does this do... I wonder how much cl the Shadow Strike does compared to the overload. Let's try that. So, overload does, like, fuck all. Oh, man! Oh, yeah. Shadow Strike fucking annihilated compared to, uh... Compared to that. I should probably get down from here, because this guy's about to round the corner and fuck me. Hello! Okay, that went well. We like that. Oh shit, people are dead. People are dead. Get up. Okay, people are dead again. That's not good. Uh Yeah, that really doesn't do shit to him, does it? This is going down. Okay, that was that was a tough one. Up you get, Kasumi. Those uh, those big boy mechs are scary. <laughs> right, I guess I should check everybody because I'm pretty sure I couldn't scan that dude during combat. So anyone who died might be scannable. Although I'm pretty sure there's a body down here and it's gone. So, maybe not. I don't know. Huh. Is that where we're going? Yeah. Let me just check these two real quick. Uh, yeah. Okay. That's about as thorough as can be, I think. All guards to cell block one. How much heavy ammo do we have now? We have ten. Going pretty well. Okay. Bad, not bad. Three thousand. Oh boy. You're valuable, Shepard. I could have sold you and lived like a king. But you're too much trouble. At least I can recapture Jack. Not happening. You're a two-bit slave trader, and I don't have time for it. 
I do the hard thing civil governments are unwilling to. This is for the good of the galaxy. Oh, yes. Locking up the man who saved the galaxy so you can kill him. That's for the good of the galaxy. <clears throat> Fucking moron. <laughs> oh my goodness, what's this shit? <clears throat> interesting, interesting. I think I have to be... I have to shoot the middle bit. Okay. Target them. <laughs> oh, this isn't good. Okay, he's got some health. Oh. I didn't realize she immediately gets back out of there. That's good. Full health. Okay, this dude's got shields. No, he doesn't. Just kidding. Wait, she can't... I guess we can't climb up there, so she can't shadow strike him there. Easy. Damn! Cerberus. So what are you in for? <laughs> what the hell do you want? Uh... To rescue you? I'm not sure if this is... I want to say both of these, but I don't know if they both advance the conversation or if this is a left-hand side is additional kind of situation. I'm just going to go with to rescue you. I might be missing out on dialogue by not clicking that, but it feels like that is going to advance the conversation and not let me click this, and I'd rather click that. <laughs> You're in a bad situation, and I'm going to get you out of here. Shit, you sound like a pussy. <laughs> I'm not going anywhere with you. You're Cerberus. Uh, why does it matter if I'm with Cerberus? Because they're fucking years. twats. Anytime I get free, they put a huge bounty on me. That's why Warden Curl figured he'd struck gold when he caught me. It isn't working out too well for him. I don't want to say this, even though it's just like extra dialogue. I'm here to ask for your help. You show up in a Cerberus frigate to take me away somewhere? You think I'm stupid? <laughs> oh my god. This ship is going down in flames. We can get you to safety and we're asking for your help. We could knock her out and take her. I'd like to see you try. Nah. We're not gonna attack her. Good move. Look, you want me to come with you? Make it worth my while. Join my team and I'll do what I can for you. Don't make promises you can't keep. I bet your ship's got lots of Cerberus databases. I want to look at those files, see what Cerberus has got on me. Sure. You want me on your team? Let me go through those databases. <laughs> yes, bluff, okay. I'll give you full access. You better be straight up with me. So why the hell are we standing hey, here? Hey, I hate Cerberus just as Move much up. as you do. That was great. Nice, level up.
That was really good. Recruited prisoner known as Jack for the team. Purgatory's betrayal of Shepard, unacceptable. Fortunately, was able to reverse credit transfer. <laughs> May have to take steps against Blue Suns to demonstrate consequences of interference. Oh, 20%. 20%? That's big. That's big. I'm definitely getting that. Shotgun damage up 10%. That's also very nice. 30k. Some element zero. We live in large. 